What's good, people? It's your boy, the Monox Beard Bro, back with the one year update. I really can't believe it's already been a year. Oh my God, it's been a crazy journey. This beard journey, um, for everyone who stuck with it and stuck with me, that's what's up. And hello again. I know it's been a long while. So how's everybody doing? Let me know if you just started your journey, leave a comment down below where you started, where you're starting from, how you started, why you started, and how long you've been on your journey for. Anyway guys, this is the one year update for me. And honestly, when I think back on this past year, it feels like it was a long journey, like starting off. But thinking back now, it seems like it just flew by. It's weird, I can't really explain it. But um, let me go ahead and show you my gains, all right? Clearly it's been over a year um, on the Minox. I didn't update exactly at one year, so it's been like a year and like a month or two, something like that. Um, but basically my gains haven't changed too much. I really wanted to grow out just to show you guys the gains that I have made and the potential I have to actually grow an even larger beard. So. A lot of the time I've been having to shave, so my beard is always short or trimmed up. And this is the growth I'm at right now. So if you've been with me since the beginning, you know that I've always, I've never had trouble growing my sideburns. I always had like a chin strap and I always could grow a goatee and under my chin has always been full. My only problem was growing in my cheeks. And that's really been filling in a lot. So to someone who hasn't been following my journey, they would just assume I could always grow a beard. It looks very natural and just looks pretty full. It's coming in really nicely and I'm, I'm very excited about that. So there's also one more thing I wanna to talk to you about. This is December 31st, a day before 2020. And we all have goals we wanna set and hopefully achieve the new year. And one thing I wanna do is in 2020, I really want to get start getting into shape, okay? I'm generally a skinny guy, okay? I've never been able to put on a lot of weight. And one thing I want to do in 2020 is really put on some real muscle mass. Not crazy muscle mass, but more than what I got. I'm a slender dude, athletic, you know, cut, but just skinny, you know what I mean? Slimmer than I'd like to be. So in 2020, I want, definitely want to bulk up and I kind of want to transition this channel into not only just beard health in general, but general like fitness health also. Um, I'm pretty much a novice at this point though, so I'm gonna be doing a lot of research on how I can bulk myself up, gain some muscle mass, because we got the beard gains. <laughs> now it's time to try to get some muscle gains. So if y'all are down, I would love for this channel to kind of go that route. Let me know in the comments below if that's what y'all want to see or should I just keep this channel strictly about the beard, the beard. Anyway guys, before this year ends, I want to thank everybody who ever left any love down below, comment, subscribed. I, I'm still getting comments even though I haven't up, updated in a long time, comments about I, how I motivated you guys into starting this journey. Remember guys, it's all about you. You guys were searching, y'all were curious, and I'm just like, I nudged y'all over the hill. Give yourself more credit than that. Um, one thing I do wanna emphasize though, especially to the guys who are just starting out, I say this in a lot of my videos, consistency, okay, is key. Consistency, try to stay consistent. Um, it's gonna be a good two months or longer before you see anything, okay? I get a lot of questions like, man, I've been doing this for a month, a month and a half, and I don't see anything. Yeah, you probably won't, okay? Don't let that discourage you. Consistency and patience. C and P, all right? Keep that up. Believe me, around 11 weeks, 12 weeks, you'll start seeing something. Not a lot, you'll start seeing something. Some faster than others, okay? So, consistency and patience. And with that said, guys, I want to dedicate the rest of this video to you guys. If you guys don't know, I have an email that I've told y'all to send me your progress shots to monoxidobeardbro at hotmail. Yeah, no one uses hotmail anymore, but I do. 
All right, Manox Little Beard Bro at Hotmail.com. You guys have seen me y'all's progress on your journey, and I want to just let the rest of this channel know and see that it is very possible with Minoxidil to grow a beard. There's still a lot of doubters out there. So this is from me to y'all, and this is all y'all. This is the Beard Bro community, and I'm proud of it. I'm proud to be a part of it, and we just gotta keep each other motivated and keep it pushing, baby, into 2020 and beyond. Guys, thanks for joining me. Peace, but stick around, and this is you guys. Laters.